All right. Now we're doing free code camp, responsive web design, learn HTML by building a cat photo app. Step 35. All right. So now we're going to add a web form to collect information from users. After the cat form heading, we'll add a form element. All right. So let's go check out this uh, form element before we get to it. Form element HTML. Uh, we're going to come have to come down to this one right here because this one is uh, completely, well, I mean, it's related, but it's different. All right. So an HTML form is used to collect user input. The user input is most often sent to a server for processing, right? So if we try it ourselves and we have a form action and then we'll have action page.php, uh, this is where it's sent to. Uh, then we'll have label for and uh, F name, first name, label, and then break. That's this thing right here. And then we have an input type text, ID, first name, so this four is linking to this. We don't need, you don't, we're going to get to this in a few, le, in a few uh, courses. But anyway, the four links to this, pardon me, this ID link links to this four. And the name uh, is, I forgot what the name does. Anyway, and then value is uh, John in here. So this input type is text. And so this box is a text. Anyway, regardless, let's get back to it. Uh, so what we're going to do here is we're going to have a form element like this, and then we're going to close the form like that. And when we say check the code, it looks good. And then we're going to submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 36 and we'll see you next time.